Guests today say their secrets are tearing their relationships apart. Please meet Katie. She says she needs to get something off her chest. Katie, what is going on? Hi, Jerry. Hi. Well, I got a secret to tell my boyfriend. Uh-oh, what? Well, I just found out I was pregnant, and the thing is, it might not be his. So, who have you been sleeping with? Uh, I've been sleeping. I slept with our friend PJ. It's actually my boyfriend's friend. Why would you do that? How did that happen? Well, you know, me and Sean, my boyfriend, we've been going through a lot of ups and downs. Like, we were living in a... Sounds like you've been going up and down with your boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I don't know what position, but I'm just saying. <laughs> What's going on? Yeah. Well, the thing is, you know, me and Sean moved from Michigan to Duluth. And when we moved to Duluth, Minnesota... You moved to Duluth? Minnesota, yeah. Well, that's what happened, see? <laughs> <laughs> but we were living in a tent. So we've been going through a lot the past six or seven months. And they have buildings in Duluth. They do have buildings see, in Duluth. Go. Um... You know, we've been going through a lot of ups and downs. We've been together for six or seven months now, and we moved about 30 miles north of Duluth, and we've been trying to have a baby, and he's been stressing out about work, and PJ just became a part of the family. Yeah. And he was over there one day, and my boyfriend was at work, and we were drinking, playing video games, and dance, listening to music, just dance, just being crazy. and. I just had too much to drink, and I kissed him, and kiss him led to touch him, and touch him led to... I don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear that. <laughs> but you're pregnant now. Yes. And you're thinking it could be... Right, because no. the week I slept with him was the week that I probably conceived, and I slept with both of them the same week. Oh. So what, what are you going to do now? I mean, you're going to tell him, but... I'm going to tell him, and I hope he forgives me. I want him to So you be still want to be with your boyfriend? Right, yeah. He's like a father what to if, my what son. What happens the next time you go drinking? Well, I'm not going to drink anymore. I'm just done with it. It just leads to too much trouble, and you I don't want to lose yeah. him. Yeah. Well, okay. I'll let you tell him. Uh, oh, he's not. Yeah, he's outside the studio, so he hasn't seen this, so he doesn't know what you're going to tell him. But let's bring out your boyfriend, Sean. Welcome to the... Oh. See, we're a romantic show. Nice to have you with us, Sean. Thanks, Jerry. Good to see you. What do you want? It seems like a nice guy. What do you want to tell him? Wow, baby. You know how many ups and downs we've had for the past two years, even in the last, like, three months. And I finally got pregnant. But the thing is, I don't know if it's yours or not. What do you mean you don't know if it's mine? I mean that I... I cheated on you with PJ. After everything we've been through, we've been trying to have a kid for the last six months. I've moved away from my whole family for you. I've done everything to show you how much I care about you. I'm so sorry. With someone I work with, too. With everything we've been going through, I, I mean, we ju you just had a miscarriage. You know, he, you just aren't there for me emotionally. Like, whenever I'm crying about anything, you tell me to change my tampon. Like, you're just not there for me. <laughs> and PJ was. Is that true? <laughs> I mean, you know, we're struggling. I'm not saying it doesn't have to be changed from time to time. I'm just saying... <laughs> He's like a nice guy. He's but a for the great guy, thing. but buying diapers and going to work and paying the bills, that's great and everything, but I need you to be there for me emotionally. When I'm crying, I need you to put me into your arms. I need you to tell me I'm pretty. And, you know, PJ was there. He was doing all that. And, yeah, we had a couple of drinks. It was a bad decision, and now I'm really regretting it. But it wasn't a good decision. You're saying you're sorry, but you still want to be with him? 
I want him to be with me. I want him to raise the child I'm pregnant with. I want him to be the father to my son. I want to well, marry him. Okay, there's, okay, so obviously if it is his son, which you're saying it's possible it is, so it is, if it is your son, then the issue is do you forgive her for sleeping with uh, your friend? If it isn't your son and it's PJ's son, then what happens? hope he would still be there for me and realize it was just a mistake. A so you don't want mistake. to be with PJ even if he's the father? No way. Well, I haven't met the guy. I want to be with Sean. He's an amazing person. Well, let's meet PJ. Here is PJ. <laughs> Whoa. I mean, I can't believe I knocked up girls this year. How could you take advantage of me in a situation like that? Knowing how vulnerable I am right after having the miscarriage. Did you sleep with him when his hair was like that? <laughs> yes. Well, I thought you were on birth control. You knew I wasn't on birth control. You knew everything about our situation, PJ. You practically live at our house and you had to cop out and be a bitch like that. I'm 18 years old. You know, I just want to party, have fun, get I'm not ready to be a father again. <laughs> How could you do that to me, PJ? I wasn't How could I do that to, when I make you dinner when you know that we struggle anyways with food? Well, why are you yelling at, why are you upset with, um, with him because you didn't have to because sleep with him? Because, Jerry, you know, we, he brought over the alcohol and he brought it over when my old man was at work and I Your old man? How old are you? 29. I have My socks that age. boyfriend. <laughs> but he brought it over knowing what was going to happen. I didn't know we were going to sleep together. We drank before, nothing happened. When Sean was around? I don't think he ever goes someplace assuming he's going to get to sleep with someone. <laughs> I'm just saying, because you don't know. Yeah. Uh, what, yeah, what, what, what do you want to say to him? I look like an idiot now. What? You just think it's some big party? You got your little mohawk, act like you're so cool, what? I wasn't thinking of the consequences, man, and I'm sorry, you know, I was drunk, I wasn't thinking about anything. You ain't thinking of the consequences? No, it was, I was drunk. I when was I sit like... around talking with you, what do you think? You think that I'm just, what, some punk? You think I'm joking? No. You don't, you, you don't, you ain't thinking about the consequences, huh? No. Yeah, I hope you might want to look for a new job. What if it's your, okay, hold on for a second. What if it's your, uh, what if you are the father? Nah, I gotta take care of business and, you know, help her out as much as I can. PJ, if it is your kid, I don't want you anywhere near it. The way you act, the way you talk, the way you do everything you do, I don't want you as a father to my child. No way, you're just a little 18 year old boy. You... Oh. No. No, I want, if well, it's yours, sure be 19. I want you out of our lives. There are two options. The child is obviously either yours or his. What, what, what's going to happen? Do you still love her? I love her more than anything in the world, Jerry. And you say you love him? I love him to die. So obviously you hope it's your child. Yeah. And if it's not your child, what's going to happen here? Honestly, I, I don't know. That's a fair answer, you know. I'll be devastated if it's not his. But it's possible. It is possible. I just don't want you it to be. You still want to be with him? I want to be with him for the rest of my life. Okay. PJ was just a mistake. If he cut his hair? <laughs> we'll be back. <laughs> If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing, take care of yourself and each other.